What's good everybody? This is Dre of Just Dre 365. In this video, I'm gonna show you how I quickly edit Zoom interviews. With social distancing guidelines still in place, Zoom has been an affordable place where people have been able to conduct their remote interviews. In this video, I'm gonna show you how I quickly edit multi-talent interviews that are recorded in Zoom. Let's head over to Final Cut Pro where I already have my project set up. So the first thing that I'm going to do is obviously drop something in my timeline. So I'm just gonna title this Zoom Edit. So I'm just gonna drop down the Zoom interview. And me, I like to just get it off the timeline. So I'm just gonna lift from Storyline. And I'm just gonna quickly run through this to see where the video starts. I'm gonna cut it, delete it out. So the first thing I'm gonna do is set up my two talent camera shot. So, lift those up. I am going to hide that one. And actually, sorry, I'm actually gonna bring in my background real quick. Um, stretch this out. Okay, got my background in place. I'm just gonna stretch it a little bit. Might adjust that later. So right now, I am going to crop my Zoom video for the host and also for the talent and put them on separate lines. And you'll see why I do this later. So the left is going to be 640. Oops, oh, sorry. Zero. So the right is gonna be 640. Top 180, bottom 180. I'm gonna do the same for this one. Left 640. There's nothing to do on the right. Top 180, bottom 180. Perfect. So now I have two independent clips as you can see. And so now I am going to bring in just a plain white backdrop. I'll put that right here and I'm gonna use this as my border, basic border around the videos. So I'm gonna just stretch this out for the timeline. Boom. I'm going to change the color real quick to white. Let's see, let's, let's uh, put this at uh, 47%. We'll change the back to 47%. Oh, that's not supposed to happen. Hmm, where'd it go? Okay, so we're gonna do 47% on the 47% on the backdrop. And I'm just gonna hide this one. And then I'm gonna make this one about 45%. Actually, no, sorry, we'll make it about 90%. And we'll just, so that'd be the border. I'm just gonna make it easy and just slide them both over. So this would be my host. And then I am going to bring this up. I'm going to duplicate this. And I'm going to bring this down to 90% and I'm just going to bring this one over to go behind them behind her I'm just gonna slide them both over boom so that's my two camera shots set up and there's now I'm just also going to drop the logo on top so it'll be easier. So it's already there. Just stretching it out for the whole video. And boom, it's lined up perfectly. So right now I have my host talking to her talent. This is gonna be now one of the shots that I'm gonna use throughout the video. 
So I have this shot set up. So now I'm just gonna duplicate this. I'm gonna title it, Zoom Edit Do Not Touch Two Shot. And then I, now I'm going to duplicate this one. Zoom, zoom, edit, two shot. Now, right now I'm going to set up my one shot. So I'm gonna delete this talent. Sorry, before I do that, let me go ahead and duplicate these real quick. Duplicate project. So this is going to be Zoom edit one shot. Actually, it'd be zoom edit host. Zoom edit talent. And so I'm going to click on the host. I'm going to delete that video. That one. I'm going to do this, put it back in the middle. Just going to stretch it out most of the screen. Then I'm going to take my talent, stretch her out as well, and then just line it up. So I did, she's, we'll do 165, see what we get. Perfect. And so I'm actually going to delete the logo. So now we have our one shot of the host. I'm just gonna copy this. And then I'm gonna go to my talent. Just gonna delete these. Maybe that, boom. Then put this up. Then the talent. Just gonna put that scale at 165 and slide her into place. Now I have my single shot of my talent. The next thing I'm going to do is compound these so it's easier for me to bring in when I do the multi-cam edit. So I'm just going to compound, new compound clip. Zoom edit talent, cut that out. The host, compound clip this. New compound clip, zoom edit host. And now I have my two shot. I'm going to zoom. I'm going to compound this clip as well. Now that I've compounded the clips, it makes everything much easier for when I bring into the multi-cam edit mode. So the next thing I'm gonna do is just highlight these three clips. I am going to do new multi-cam clip. I'm just gonna title this Zoom, edit, multi-cam. All these settings are pretty much good to go. Hit OK. Now it makes it, and so now I'm going to now create a new project. Do multi-zoom, edit. OK. So now I just got to bring my video down into my timeline, and then I'm going to activate my angles. Then as you can see here, I have my three different angles. Now it's much easier for me to make my cuts as the interview is being taken place. So one of my main shots is going to be my two camera setup. And so I'm just gonna quickly run through and just throw in some BS cuts just so you can see how it's working. So now I'm watching the interview, they're talking, they're laughing, they're having a great old time. My host Georgette here is talking. So now I can just cut to her. She's talking, showing some things know what she's doing. I missed that. So now the talent is talking. I'm not paying attention I'm behind because I'm missing everything. But as you can see, I'm making these cuts as I'm watching the interview and it just makes everything much easier. And there it is. So now it's, you can easily see the cuts on the timeline. So as I'm playing through, I'm just gonna fast forward so you can kind of see what's happening here as the cuts are being made. Let's 
So as you can see, as you can see, this is a very quick video on how I set up my timeline to edit Zoom interviews. When editing a Zoom interview and creating multiple compound clips makes it much easier to edit using the multi-cam feature. I know this is a very quick tutorial, but this is how I do my edits when I'm editing Zoom interviews for people. Stay tuned for the next video.